Sonny. Hi, I'm Julie. And we're here today to talk about the 5D Embroidery System, specifically 5D Design Creator. And with 5D Design Creator, there are a lot of wonderful new tools that are in the system. And they're quick and easy, right? They are. They're real easy. One of them is called Automatic Richelieu Bars. Oh, wow. It is. It's really neat. And we've got a wonderful, a uh, lot of wonderful samples that show this beautiful Richelieu technique with cut work. Okay, so the areas where the Richelieu bars are, that those are cutwork areas. They are, and those are, you can just see the bars right there. It's really pretty neat. And what's nice about Richelieu bars and cutwork, they actually stabilize when you have large areas, and they add detail when you have smaller areas. That's right, and so with these larger areas, it's holding the, the other embroidery and fabric together, whereas with the smaller areas, on the, like on this freestanding lace, you can just see just the beautiful detail, and it still holds it together, but it just adds just a wonderful touch to this beautiful lace. And it makes it more stable as a freestanding lace. It does. It's just great. Another fun new tool is actually a crosshatch fill. And you can see, again, freestanding lace. And what this crosshatch fill does is it basically holds it together in the background. Oh, okay. So that's what we're seeing in the background that goes looks like it makes little squares. It does, and you can actually change the angle of those squares as well. So you can get a totally different look with the same design. Exactly. And another neat thing is, is if you'll notice those uh, little um, lines, they're not just straight lines of stitching, they're zigzags over the top. So again, it makes it really nice and stable. That's really nice. And Julie, I know you've done a lot more with these different tools. Yes, actually two of the different techniques you were just talking about yeah. are seen in this design right here on the shawl. The dark purple sections have those Richelieu bars, adding a little bit of detail. And we also have in the lighter purple sections the crosshatch fill, again adding detail to the design. So similar, very uh, same technique, but wow does it look different it in the does. different colors and things. And different style. Yeah. We also have a new technique called embossing. Okay. So this is a satin stitch, a light purple satin stitch, and then we emboss the straight line on top of it to add some detail. Okay, so it's not two rows of satin stitching, it really is only one row. Correct. Oh, that's great. And then you'll see in the design next to it, here we did circles for the embossing instead of straight lines. So you can do anything you'd like. So you could, if, if I wanted to sign my name, I could do that too? Sure, and oh. add it to your embroidery design wow. by embossing. That's great. Now this one down here, this is a different technique. This is called a spiral fill, okay. and then we added straight lines of, of stitching on top of it to make it a little bit more stable. Okay, so the straight lines are actually what did added the stability. Correct. Okay, Correct. that's great. And also, I, you're pointing to it, I love those little points on the star, but it looks like you embossed that as well. Is that true? Actually not. Oh. That's a fill pattern. We have many fill patterns to choose from that have a, a pattern already stamped into it. So you can choose any one of those. Oh, wow, that's great. And they're at different angles, so that's real easy to do too. Yes. You'll also see there's some candle wicking sections here. We have motifs in our software, so you can create your own embroidery designs with motifs. Oh, wow, Julie. This system and especially the design creator really seems like there's a lot of great things you can do. Yes, and it's quick and easy. 